in the corner. We're about to meet someone else. It sounds like breathing. <laughs> a sharp inhale like something is sticking or sucking the air through their teeth. Someone is sucking the air through their teeth. <laughs> I got it. Are they in pain? I reach the corner and peer around it. Yuri? Oh, please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Ah! Yuri, what are you doing? Oh, I don't like it. Mm, this is hitting a little close to home and I don't like it. Oh, what the fuck? Whoa, 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 whoa! Ah, sorry, let me get. Oh, whoa, I got bored heading 10 minutes past, I'm back. Whoa! Was that warning me future? I don't like it. I'm back. Thanks for waiting patiently. Big Papa, do you like long tea? I'm kind of in shock right now, Yuri. Uh, yeah. Anything is fine. Very well. Yuri sets the temperature on the kettle to 200 degrees. It's time to get the teapot. You really do this properly, don't you? Of course. I shouldn't do any less than when I'm making tea for others. Even if I'm not an expert on tea or anything? <laughs> in that case, you'll be even more impressed. Ah, perhaps I will. Yuri fetches the teapot and begins measuring the tea leaves. Do, do we have the water back? To my surprise, she even starts humming a little to herself. You must be in a good mood now. Is that so? I was letting it show. And you noticed. I was doing a bit of thinking. And I decided that I would try to express myself a little bit more. It turns out, it's not very hard for me to do. When it's you who's around anyway. Uh, Cookie time. Oh, that scared me. Look at the history. The history? Would it have been there? Oh! Birds with the treats! Want some treaties? Oh, would it have been there? All the crazy stuff that just happened? Here, eat this like a normal goof. Here you go. This one's for you. There you go, say thank you for them treaties. Also, Birch, I think you can do exclamation point listen. And that'll get my attention too. Would that have been Cookie in there? Time. And Yuri! With the British as well! It's missing? Would there have been something there? Uh, our illustrious champion returns. Oh, snap. Welcome home. It's, it's, uh. Yuri, you've been dethroned, my dude. That's the problem when, uh, <laughs> that stuff doesn't get changed. What? <laughs> Alright, you get two alerts, Scuffs. Uh, we'll switch this over real quick. There we go. There we go. There we go. All better, all better. The whole interaction was in place. Oh! I didn't know that. I should probably save, huh? I haven't done that all stream. What time is it? It's off an hour and a half. Okay. That's great, Yuri. Just don't push yourself too much. Oh god! Why does that keep going off? Oh my god! Hello, friend. <laughs> it's also. Hold on. It's G U P P Y Y B T W. G U P P Y Y B T W. There we go. There we go. All right. <laughs> There's like seven alerts that are going off. <sighs> you forgot the biddies though. I thought I gave them to him because I gave them to you right after Birch. Yeah, I gave them to him. You didn't like the at in the last one. 
How come yours puts an at in them? Um, let's see. Oh, because you did at Guppy. I get it. I got you. And uh, we got something else. Yuri with the bits. You want some bitties? Put some more bitties. You guys are getting all the bitties today. Delicious bitties. Um, um, Mom is just Ooh, sitting on his throne. Oh my goodness. And Sarah with the cookies. Um, 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 um. Hello, friend. Hello, friends. Welcome, everyone. How is all your lovely faces? What is new? What is crazy? What is exciting? Oh God! There's another one. You're going to find more bitties. Crookie time. <laughs> See, thank you for the five more bitties. Nom nom nom. Nom 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 nom. Just making sure that lid wasn't screwed on too tight. <laughs> oh, guys, I have strong. I have starburst. I forgot I had starburst. Hold on. Mmm, me a happy thing. Mmm. Oh, that scared me. Apparently, my mouse wasn't over the game. And I clicked over here, so my game minimized, and I thought something scary was gonna happen. Shower time! No, man! No problem, man. Look away. Alright, mental note. I should not be eating on stream. Mmm. It's very endearing. That's. Yuri wasn't kidding. I don't even know if I can keep up with this. Where'd you already prepare a cup of tea for each of us? I can fly. Hey, and Crimson Rose is here! How's it going, Crimson? Hmm. Your Halloween cups look fantastic. What'd you get? Also, how was your first day at your new job? Hmm. I should not have ate this Starburst. You know, my mouth is full of saliva and I have to speak. Big Papa, I have another request. Do you mind if we sit on the floor today? Eh? Why is that? It's a little like easy, easier on my back. I can re read with my back against the wall rather than bending over at my desk. Oh, sorry, I didn't realize. No worries. I just have back pain very regularly, so I do my best to manage it. Is that so? I wonder why that is. It's most likely, er, it's most likely because my, uh, my. Your posture, right? Always hunched over like that one while we're reading. Y yes, I have terrible reading posture. But that's why we should sit on the floor. Fair enough. Hey! Stop slurping. I'll go ahead and get the book. I retrieved the book from my bag. Ah, I have some chocolate as well. It's a bag of small chocolate candies. I take it since we'll go well with the tea. Yuri and I and sit Yuri and I then sit against the wall, teacups at our sides. As if in sync, we assume the same reading position as last time, each holding one half of the book. Except this time, our bodies are even closer to each other. I can't see too well. Yuri, er, Yuri slides closer until her shoulders are touching. <laughs> How am I supposed to focus on reading like this? Yuri was always kind of cute, but... I can smell her hair. It smells like strawberries. When she's being less apprehensive, it's almost more than I can handle. Your teacup. Yuri hands me my teacup. Holding it... With my hands that's not holding the book, I end up in a position that makes it even harder to focus. Because now I need to worry about making sure I don't accidentally touch her chest. Meanwhile, Yuri hasn't noticed a single thing. She swears her intent she wears her intense reading expression, and I can only presume the world around her has faded away. I use all of my willpower to focus on reading. After a few minutes, I finally managed to relax a little. I put the teacup between my legs and fumbled with the chocolate wrapper. Uh, sorry. I briefly let go of the book to finish opening the wrapper. You can have as much as you want. Oh, thanks. That's okay. I won't take any. Yeah? You sure? Well, the 
if I touch it, then I might get smudges on the pages. Oh, you're right. I didn't even think about that. My bad. No need to apologize. I'll hold the book, okay? Are you sure? Of course. I can do the chocolate thing again. It was good? Good, I'm glad. Making tea all day? Sounds fun. Yuri opens the book with both hands. She holds it so I don't have any harder time of reading it. As a result, her left arm is practically resting on top of my leg. Well, in that case, Yuri is already totally focused on reading again. I take a chocolate candy and pop it into my mouth. Then I take another chocolate and I hold it up to Yuri. She doesn't even look away from the book. She simply parts her lips, as if the situation was completely natural. But that means I can't stop here. I apprehensively place the chocolate in her mouth. Yeah, the little chocolate. I love it. <laughs> Just like that, Yuri closes her lips open. Eh? Yuri's expression suddenly breaks. Did... Did I just... Yuri looks at me like she needs to confirm what just happened. Uh, um... Big Papa... S sorry... Or sorry. I guess I shouldn't have done that. Uh, Why does the music stop? Yuri starts to breathe heavily. Er, Yuri starts to breathe heavily. I... I can't... Big Papa... Suddenly, Yuri forcefully grabs my arm and jerks me to my feet. That's not how this happened before. My teacup gets knocked over. Hi. I thought we were outside. I guess you said we sat on the floor. I, I guess I kind of assumed we went outside. Oh, missed. Back for a quick second. No problem, man. Big Papa. Whoa. Wait. Are we actually going to the closet like I thought we were? And also the music's gone. I don't like when the music cuts out. Bad things happen. My heart. My heart won't stop pounding, Big Papa. That's a good thing. Hearts should pound. At least they should beat. Can't calm down. I can't focus on anything anymore. Can you feel it, Big Papa? Yuri suddenly presses my hand against her chest. Oh la la. Whoa. Okay, I don't like it anymore. Why is this happening to me? I feel like I'm losing my mind. Okay, I don't like this now. Oh, especially with that expression. Oh, I don't like the music. I don't want to go forward anymore. I don't want to go forward anymore. I want to be done. There's nothing new in the game files. I can't make it stop. It even makes me not want to read. Whoa. I just want to look at you. Ah! Fucking no! Oh my god, the eyes are moving. That's not okay. Why is that gotta be terrifying? Okay, I'm cold again. Dude, oh, her eyes are fucked up. Did they Photoshop in actual eyeballs? And why is she so dark? Can you guys see it? You guys can see it, okay. Like, it looks like just a black screen on OBS. Ugh. <sighs> Do you need to go Jill off? Like, I'll leave you alone. Fuck. <sighs> can you stop looking directly at me? It's freaking me out. <sighs> ah! God! <sighs> Okay, Monica, thank you. For the first time you just popping in. I am glad. Oh my god. Oh, she's always popping in everywhere, man. Oh, this is the first time I'm happy she did that, though. Oh my god, that was freaky. I did not like the eyeball situation. Mm. Whoo! It's time to share poems! Okay.
We'll come back to you in a minute, Yuri. Big Papa, I think you, you saw something earlier that you weren't supposed to see. I didn't want to have to tell you this, but I don't think I have a choice. It's getting kind of dangerous for you to spend time with Yuri. Is she referencing the cut part? I don't know why, but she seems pretty easily excitable when she's around you. Well, it shouldn't be a problem in itself. But when Yuri gets too excited, she finds a place to hide and starts cutting herself with a pocket knife. How do you know? I guess. Isn't that kind of messed up? She even brings a different one to school every day, like she has a collection or something. I mean, it's definitely not because she's depressed or anything like that. I think she should get some kind of high from it. It might even be like a sexual thing. But the point is, you've been kind of enabling her. Fuck. I'm not saying it's your fault, though. But I guess that's why I had to explain it all to you. Fuck. So I think if you keep your distance, that would probably be best for her. While you're at it, don't be shy to spend a little more time with me. Fuck. Uh, no. I should talk to her about it, see if she's okay, make sure that her wounds are cleaned and dressed and she's okay, and then make sure that she, she has someone to talk to if she feels like she needs to do that again. Not ignore her. Ah! You're convinced that Yuri is secretly a serial killer? I hope not, because I love her. Oh. Uh, although, Monica's getting definitely way more possessive. I at least have it together in the head, and I how to treat the club, how to treat my club members. You just said leave, like totally ignore Yuri. That's not good treatment of your club members. But anyway, you want to read my poem now? I like the way this one turned out, so I hope you do too. Fucking flies! Oh no! Ah, it's different. I don't like it. I thought it was gonna be a save me, uh, reset me again. Save me the colors. They won't write beautiful. Okay, there's no more files, but they're missing letters. Bright, beautiful colors, flashing, expanding, piercing, red, green, blue. An endless concophony of meaningless noise. The noise, it won't stop. Violent greeting. Don't know what that is. Squeaking, screeching, piercing, sine, cosine, tangent, like playing a chalkboard on a turntable, like playing a knife on a beating ribcage. Fuck. Endless something of muggles. <laughs> of meaningless, maybe. Delete her is scary. Okay, I want to open up a notepad. And see if any of these letters mean anything. Also, I can't have the game open right now, so I'm just gonna have OBS over here. Okay, so what are the letters that I'm missing? Let's see. The colors, they won't write. B-E-A-U-T-I-F-U-L-C-O-O. -O. Flashing, expanding, piercing red, green, blue, and endless concophony of meaningless noise. The noise, it won't stop. All right, gotta scroll down now. All right, the noise, it won't stop. Violent, grating. What is that word? Grating. I don't even know that. Also, it doesn't look like it's spelling anything. So far, it's U-I-O-O-I-A-E-E. -E. So, throw that theory out the window. Oh, that's OBS. No wonder I can't scroll. I don't know what the, um... I feel like there's something hidden here. But... U-I... 